Welcome to the Dragados Flatiron Precast Facility near Hanford, California. 30 minutes south of the city of Fresno. Since 2018, rain or shine, we've been cranking out crucial concrete components for construction package 2-3, a 65-mile-long section of the high-speed rail project in the Central Valley. Precast manager Craig Watts keeps things running. So this is one of the largest single-use facilities, uh, not only in the state of California, but you know across the nation, it's one of the largest. In the end, a total of more than 2,300 precast concrete beam girders will come out of this facility. This right here is one of the largest beams that this facility manufactures. It's 124 feet long, four feet wide, and over eight feet high. For reference, I'm under six feet. Beams like this one are absolutely crucial for high-speed rail in the Central Valley. And this facility has created over 1,400 of such beams right here at home near Hanford. To maintain our speeds of 200 plus miles per hour, our trains need to stay flat and curve gently. So beam girders like these help us go over various obstacles all over the valley. Just next to the facility is the Hanford Viaduct, where for months we've been placing these girders on top of the columns. This big structure is also ideal for our future Kings to Larry Regional High Speed Rail Station. A total of 978 precast concrete girders are needed for the viaduct and station. Nearly 300 of those have been placed to date. Here's Glenn Lawson, the Deputy Contract Manager for Construction Package 2-3. We're nearing the end of that segment, so we're almost a third of the way through uh, installing the girders here at the Hanford Viaduct. Day and night, these facilities hum. Sometimes conditions are best for people and concrete in the early morning or late at night, especially during the often scorching Central Valley summers. Most days it runs 24 hours a day, so we work around the weather. And so if it's heavy rain, there's usually stuff that can go on, especially under the big top here. And then during the summer months when it's really hot, we will typically start at midnight in order to beat the heat. These innovative and busy facilities are full tilt, building something never seen before in this state or country. 100% renewably powered and 200 plus mile per hour high speed trains. 